So make sure you take a toothbrush that you don't need, and you're gonna basically just chop the head off right here. Make sure you put the positive up to the negative end and so on so they look like this. Here I have one of these DC motors that I took from a Nokia phone. This is the vibrator motor. You can find it in other phones as well. And I already wired up some wires to it and I'm about to connect it to this thing. So the first step is you're going to glue the solar panel, which consists of two actual solar panels that are 1.5 volts each that basically makes up 3 volts. You have wires sticking out from here, and you're basically just going to glue it on to here. And also pull the wires through these holes. Now at the bottom of our solar panel, we'll be soldering the negative wire, this is the negative wire right here, to the positive end on the DC motor. So now you're going to wire the positive end from the solar panel, which is this, to one of the sides onto the switch, and then the negative side of the DC motor, which you're going to wire to the other side of the switch. So the next step is you're going to super glue two of these donut rings they basically are going to hold our axle right here with the gear on so we're going to super glue it right there one of them will go up there and the other one will go right there let's do that and as you can see over here i put some hot glue just like that and over here so that the gear 
doesn't move around. So now it's solid and it won't go off contact with the other gear. Now we're going to glue the straw I have right here to here. So as you can see, now I'm done making holes in these bottle caps using the soldering iron. So now we're going to glue the wheels on. So now I'm finished making my solar powered car. As you can see here, I also decided to glue on some rubber tires on. And the rubber comes from the inner tubing of a bike tire. Let's test this thing out. Okay guys, that's about it for this week's video. I had a lot of fun making these three toys. I like them all, but my personal favorite is the Bristlebot. It is very small and it's just hilarious how it moves around. If you enjoyed watching this video, be sure to hit it a big thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't yet, and also share it with your friends. Thanks for watching guys! See you next week! Peace! Oh my god, has a big bristle bot. I better run.